What about um, some of the different modes? This is the beats mode. Now, the beats mode has some extra damage in here, and let's take a, a closer look at it. Okay, now obviously we've done this. And basically live is just putting a, a larger beat matrix over this. If I go here, and then somewhere in the middle, sorry, I keep pulling that other one down, somewhere in the middle would be like eighth notes. Okay, these are really, really cool sounding grooves. Okay, let's go for the purpose of demonstrating this next bit. I'm gonna go all the way out to transients, these guys. Here's the deal. When you're moving warp markers around, the possibility exists, as in right there, where I have moved something beyond the available audio, and there's sort of a, a empty hole there. Now, if I have this, the signal is the playhead is going to go straight to this hole and stop. You can see the, the visual representation. It'll stop, play a gap, and then go through. So it gives a really gaty sound. Okay, the next version is just a looping. And it, what, it, what it'll do now is it'll come, the playhead will come here, go to the end of the loop, and then it's going to go back a half, half again copy it till it has enough time to go through. So it's kind of like a doubling of this part here. Check it out. Okay, the next one is a reversal. Live plays, and it goes through to this. And then in order to fill this hole, it goes reverse just long enough to the, fill the next beat as here. And these things become, you know, quite apparent way down. Okay. Okay, lastly, um, down here, this is texture or tones. Now listen very closely. how this is going to affect my swing. Watch this. Okay, and in my own work, when I want to really make handmade grooves, which is most of the time, I take this grid off, and you may not even be able to see it. i got to get it up so you can see it here. I take the grid off just like this and then I move this around while I'm listening. And I'll just take sections either gray or warped and just move them. And make it swing really hard. Okay, that's tones and grain size. Next last one would be texture. You'll notice on this texture that it is only one beat that I'm working with right here. That's cool. And I actually did a little transpose here, a little cheat, cheat thing, but in this context, the, the swing mode is flux. I know what flux is. Okay, it's a little bit more subtle to hear. In the next session, we're going to look at quantizing audio and look at some of the overall groove functions that Live has.